What's up martial artists and welcome to a new video on my channel. Last week we learned that UFC welterweight champion and the current top pound for pound fighter in the sport Kamaru Usman, considered jumping up to 205 pounds to challenge Blachowicz for the light heavyweight title. Well, now Usman's manager is hoping the Nigerian nightmare sets his sights a little lower, to 185 pounds to be exact. Speaking with TMZ Sports, Ali Abdelaziz discussed what's next for his client, saying that first Usman would defend his welterweight title against Leon Edwards. But after that business was taken care of, Abdelaziz said he hoped Usman would finally jump up to middleweight to pursue his second UFC belt. The next victim is Leon Edwards, Abdelaziz said. Great fighter but he will get finished under three rounds. Fact, it's gonna happen. The welterweight division in the UFC right now is very interesting. Kamaru's gonna beat him. I want him to beat Leon Edwards and then I want him to go fight Israel Adesanya for the middleweight title. Usman has competed his entire career at welterweight and has been astonishingly successful in doing so. After winning the UFC welterweight title in 2019, Usman has since rattled off five successful title defenses and cemented himself among the all-time greats in MMA history. His dominance at welterweight has led many fans to call for Usman to make a run at the middleweight title, however, Usman's relationship with current champion Israel Adesanya has prevented that from happening. Usman and Adesanya were both born in Nigeria and have forged a friendship from their shared background, with Usman saying he would only compete against Adesanya if the UFC threw an exorbitant amount of money at them. Well, Abdelaziz seems to think that there is a price to make the fight happen and that it's more achievable than many believe. Listen, these guys, they're cool but I don't think they're best friends, Abdelaziz said. If there is enough money for both of them to fight, they will fight in the parking lot. I know how people work. This has nothing to do with loyalty, because these guys, it's not like they're training partners or brothers. They're African brothers and that holds a lot of value, but at the end of the day, I'm Kamaru Usman's team all the way. I want to see Kamaru Usman, before the end of the road, have two titles. I'm selfish, I'm greedy, and I think Kamaru deserves it. Abdelaziz continued talking about that he wants to make this fight happen, and that Mike Tyson told him that if they're real brothers, they should fight for them to make money. But before Abdelaziz or the UFC can get ahead of themselves, both men have title defenses they need to take care of. Though a date is not currently set, Usman is expected to defend his welterweight belt against Leon Edwards later this year. Meanwhile, Adesanya is scheduled to rematch Robert Whitaker at UFC 271 on February 12. I'm curious how it will go on there, but feel free to let me your opinion in the comments down below and, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more daily news. See you next time.